In this video, I'm going to show you how you can use a TI-82 stats to calculate mean and standard deviation. And I'll show you how you can do this with and without a frequency column. So the first step is to access the statistics functions. And you do that, unsurprisingly, by pressing this button, stat. And we want to enter the data, so we're going to press 1. And this gets us to this editor here. Before we can input the data in the worked example I'm going to show you, is you have to clear all of the data from previous calculations. You do this in a slightly clumsy way. So you want to highlight L1 at the top, the very top of the table, then press clear and then press down. And that has wiped everything that is stored in that table. So we then want to enter our data. And for this example, we're just going to do a really simple one. So we're going to find the mean and standard deviation of one, two, three. So we need to enter one equals, two equals, three equals. That is now all of the data entered. So we want to do the calculation. And to do that, you just press stat again. And then if you press the arrow here, that takes you to the calc menu. You want to select option one for one variable statistics. And then if you simply press enter, it gives you all of your standard one variable statistics. So you can see here is your sample standard deviation with SX. You've got Sigma X, which is your population standard deviation. And then at the very top, you've got uh, your mean. So that's how you do it normally without a frequency column. If you wanted to add a frequency column, it's a little bit more complicated. So let's go back into the editor. So stat and then one, so we can go back. Then L2 is where we're going to put the frequency data. So let's just imagine we've got a really simple example. We've got our X data, one, two, three, and our frequency is just one, two, and three for each of those. So let's enter that in L2, one, two, three. That's that entered there. So we want to go back a little bit into the calculation. So we go stat, and then if we go to calc here, we can press one variable statistics. And this time we're gonna write it a little bit differently. So we're gonna to go to um, second function L1. Then we need a comma. So we put a comma here. Then second function L2. So we're entering it like L1 comma L2 and then you press enter and it gives you the one variable statistics. But this time we have our six data points that is taken into account the frequency column that we've now inputted. So this is how you do the calculation of mean and standard deviation with and without a frequency column on your TI-82 calculator. If this video was helpful to you, please like, subscribe below. And finally, thank you very much for watching.